also a fun thing a couple people i think three or two people got banned from the front page so just went up ranks by not even getting a total level i, I don't think so uh also if you remember a couple there's like three people that had my avatar well that guy got banned who was close i, I don't think he's on the second page nope he actually got banned and there was another guy who's also banned so there's now me and blood cheese left B noah got banned uh dog got banned well i got a private message rank one and two were banned supposedly Doga auto clicked for three days for this ban on purpose but my name says otherwise as he is a known bot developer if you care at all i can provide more info proof if drama is not your thing I totally understand, but I can't fact check. That's the only reason why I don't want, want to involve. I don't want to show some pictures and screenshots and it could be just someone fabricated them or something. ICBA to check them. But the guy did get banned though. That That's for real though. Yeah, he did. Um, both of them actually, I think. Basically the former rank one and rank two, both of them got banned. I don't know if you want to read this, whatever this is. And what else? Uh, regardless, grats on plus three ranks at least. Yep, that. I think that's how many I got in total. This is exactly what I said yesterday. Not so fun fact, all three of your avatar impersonators have been banned. That was a funny meme, but now I'm kind of glad I didn't get on it. Wait, there's still one guy, right? There's rank two guy still has my avatar, I think. Oh my god, dude, he got banned. <laughs> He's gone, I just gained a rank, dude. Every single one who changed to my avatar got removed, but me. <laughs> It's real. Hey, these two guys are still here. From the very beginning, they're still both Lithuanians. They're most likely going to make it to the very end and top five. So rank one was botting. Rank two was botting. Both of them got banned. Then other people took their places. There was another guy who took rank two that had my avatar. And that rank two got banned also. <laughs> Jesus Christ. No blood cheese six got banned sometime during the night after an email I sent to tip off regarding them auto clicking heads flowers. <laughs> Why would you do that? It's so stupid. Auto clicking stupid flowers? I guess while you sleep? I don't know. Like maybe. I, I don't know how it works. Maybe it doesn't like move at all. So you could literally just click like auto alk or something. Guys, I need ranks. Please ban more people. 117 attack, three levels to go. I'll have 120 cape. That is crazy. I never thought I'll, I'll go for it. That's also 115 HP. Whoa, no way I got prayer gloves. Oh, this is bad and good at the same time. I think this is where you have to use frost dragon bones. So you have to spend like 40k for a dragon bone. Charges remaining 1200. That's like 50 mil in bones. And I don't even know if they sell. It's also very funny because I did use Scrimshaw of Sacrifice. Which is supposed to destroy all the items that I get from the monster. But I guess that counted as a bonus drop. And it didn't. I, I wish it was double though. I still did not receive a single double brawling gloves. I don't even know if you can get those. And that's 111 Slayer. A reconstruction from just doing warbands. That's 98 farming, did another run of warbands. Now since I got those brawling gloves, I'm trying to upgrade my infernal puzzle box. It goes now all the way to tier 3 after completing the super short mini quest. Like, actually took one minute. You talk to two NPCs and it was completed. Wow, dude, this quest was also like three minutes. I could have done this such a long time ago. I was using so many brawlers and I was losing a lot of experience because I hope that now brawling gloves give 25% extra experience. Dude, this thing is gonna stack so nice with the Fresh Start Worlds bonus. In less than half an hour, I gained one full hunter level. This was complete random, by the way, just like I may as well do hunter. I'm fairly close to 99. Also, turns out these hunter urns don't even work in this place. I don't know how I filled this one to 1%. Maybe I caught the plain one instead of like, of like a speedy one. But I spent quite a, a lot of money on this. You also needed mud runes to enchant them. And mud runes went for like 5k each. So I spent like 750k just on mud runes. Spent like 2 mil on these. Un unusable. That's a second level. Two to go. Like yeah, I could probably get it in like an hour and 20 minutes. Just both levels, but... It's so click intense. Look, I had two Hunter Brawling Gloves, so I'm not gonna go all the way to 99 just in case I get them. Because it will be just super quick to get. But that's it, it's 98 and I think I'm like 40 minutes away. 112 Slayer. T 
two and a half hours until next level is getting slow. Also, as I wake up, I got 74 mil from regular dragon bones and then, what did I sell? Aggression scrimshaws and I got a thousand, which should be 1.2k now, frost dragon bones. Boom, we got enough for brawling gloves. Man, I have 100 mil exactly in my money pile. Well, I should probably start buying uncut gems because I don't think this is even enough for 99 crafting. Look, I don't even know what fishing level I started this at. 85 currently. Ladies and gentlemen, four hours until the final week begins. So I'm just kind of AFK fishing right now, just here. I'm checking the high score so I know where I am right now. I am currently ranked 24. I actually climbed up one rank since yesterday, but I'm barely holding on. But come on, is it really that bad? Like if you look at my stats, like in my last video, somebody said like, what are you doing? Why are you still leveling up Slayer? It's so slow. You're barely getting any levels now. If you train something like runecrafting, you could like get so many levels and be in the front page. But I guess I hate runecrafting so much. So I'm waiting until the final week begins, which should be, I don't know, it's a 7.14 right now. So four hours. Guys, my aura has just depleted. It's been active for two hours. And I don't even know the amount that I pickpocketed. I, I was clicking, obviously, because I got them trapped. I got 5,000 feathers. Not bad. I, um, that's minus 1k because you're supposed to get like 3,000 an hour. Exactly in one week, the competitive mode ends. And if you manage to get into top 100 in any of the skills, you get some sort of halo. But again, I didn't read anything about it. I don't know if it's tradable. I don't know... Well, it's clearly there because only top 100 people. But it doesn't work for total level. You get into top 100, you get no halo. But if you get into top 100 attack, you'll get a halo. But I'm, I believe everyone's like 200 mil at least. Well, actually, I'm very curious. See, yeah, 200 mil. But um, what about the third page? Still, top 75 is 200 mil. I, hey, I guess it's correctly. Yep, everyone is 200 mil. How? F Barely, you see? <laughs> this guy's unlucky. I am currently top 81 in Herblor, but I do have a lot of potions that we'll be making, so hopefully I'll stay in top 100, although it's kind of unlikely. Summoning, I'm rank 37, so it looks even better. However, people have collected a bunch of charms and they're just keeping in the bank. I know there's uh, Yake, uh, he's a RuneScape 3 YouTuber. I, th I think he has like 20,000 Art Glacier KC by just AFKing on his alt account. Uh, dude, 20,000, uh, he has like 170,000 blue charms. They, they give like 2,000 experience per one pouch made. The guy has banged like 350 million summoning experience, which is beyond even 200 mil. And so you gotta guess how many people have the same thing, you know. So 37 rank, I don't trust this because I just, I think I'm gonna be like top... I don't know, 100, because apparently people don't go beyond that. However, somewhere where I will most likely get into top 100 is Invention, because Invention does not benefit from the Fresh Start World's boost. You get the same amount of experience, unless you're making something like Mechanized Chinchampas, or maybe there's something else that gives a lot of experience. But if we're talking about just disassembling or siphoning things once you level them up, uh, yeah, it's not doubled, you still get the same half a million experience and so on boys this is it game update apparently the main game has also double experience but we are now getting the maximum xp gains of 2.5 times xp in fresh start worlds for one week only that's it after this week the competitive mode ends so now it's time to go to burthor look 20 million from bannet or Almost all of them sold, but I forgot that just by mining you also make money 600 experience per potion made <laughs> Wait, Is this at the maximum? Yep, pulse score is at the maximum 10% The well is placed the wait, legendary wisdom lasts for an hour and 30 minutes Someone said order the minder and I was like, hmm, what could I use this one? It's only 2.5% what is like extra 14 experience or so per potion for an hour and a half yeah, that's pretty good. 101 Herblore. All right, half a million experience from 99 farming. Maybe I'll be able to... That's a lot of XP. I think I will. I think that's uh, Child plus Adolescent, both of them stacked. And I have like three more and then four more and all those Zygos. And Chinchompas. Okay, yeah. Oh, it's plus 6% only if Farmer's Outfit is owned. And I don't have it, I guess. I'm already 99, I see it. So whenever I release, I, I gain a level. So I can just chill for now. What if I would log off and it would never broadcast, I guess, that I got 99? Or maybe it would broadcast on the same tick as I log off. Here we go. 99 farm. Come on. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. Where's the fireworks? You hear that? Yeah. <laughs>
Nice, nice. I will still be farming because uh, farming goes to 120. So even if you get like, you know, a couple more levels before the weekends, it's still okay. It's still a couple levels by doing pretty much passive. Oh, this will collect cuttings if I gather level 72 or below. Dude, I made all of these urns and none of them worked. Like I was mining Banite, I think. Mining was not working. Then I was trying to use Hunter. Hunter was not working. I thought it was because of head oasis, you know, those scarabs that you catch, maybe the area you cannot use them. No, it has to be below level 74, uh, else it's not usable, which is not how I remember. I could actually get 99 hunter now. I am 600k away, so let me just take a small break here. Yeah? Oh, David, congratulations, 99 hunter. Thank you, thank you, everybody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody has an offer for Ganodermic Boots for 2 mil in the Grand Exchange. Please teleport quick. People who have Privdinas unlocked, they have advantage. 2 mil, confirm order, please, please, please. I was the quickest, yes. <laughs> ah, sold it, exactly, for 2 mil. Gano Boots are 2 mil, it says just sold. <laughs> Guys, this is what I mean. We were talking about uh, top 100 halos that you can get. Can you get multiple ones from multiple skills is what I asked and uh, he said, yes, you can. Looks bad, no more than two, three bill runescape three. Bro, that's like a lot. <laughs> if I can get three skills to top 100, then it's insane. What the hell? I just got Jadinko. That is crazy. <laughs> What? David, they are at least one bill each, he says. So three halos has three bill, all the inverted tokens, which I assume some of them will not go for that much, but some of them like invention 120, because currently I am ranked like 46 invention, and then I'm not even 120. So there's like 35, maybe 30 capes. I don't think there's even that. Maybe, maybe something like that. And we got one week to go. The, the, this thing is gonna be incredible. Please hold my thieving for 8 bill. I don't understand. 120 thieving? So the, the token for 8 bill. There's like 550, 120 thieves are highly doubt with 10 bill. I'm gonna check this Jadinko. I'm not sure if it's gonna be male or female. Okay, this is male. I don't know if my other one is female. Okay, please tell me this Jadinko is female. Yes. Oh my god, I got a male and female. <laughs> I can add them. Uh, what the hell is this? Spiky egg. I love how kind of active this place is. So back to the mage bank. Apparently we're going to use some brawling gloves. Maybe I should bring fishing as well. Just in case somebody puts a bubble. But we're going to be using wood cutting. Still got 244 charges left to go. Let's see. 2.5 thousand experience per chop. What was I getting before? 1.7k I think. Yeah, 25% from the infernal box. Which I, I don't think I need to bring it. Yeah, let's see, it was 2.5k. Wait, you actually do need to bring it. <laughs> How's that 25% though? I guess it stacks again with the base experience because there's no way it's 25. Wait, I'll try to two tick. Apparently it's like a divination in uh, the dungeons that you do. Uh, it's two ticking, it's quicker. And I guess that's one way to get more than like, what was it, 12, 14 logs that I was getting before. Uh, oh, that's a wood kind of level. Already? Yeah, just to reach my limit on the woodcutting. I cannot do these in a morning. Well, I just mm, gotta make sure I don't forget something. I know there is a Dragon Rider amulet that you can have, which is like plus 10% experience when you bury the bones. Ah, I forgot something. This is what Wisdom Aura would have been so good. You know, that 2.5% increase. This one. When burning bones, you gain plus 250% XP. I'm not going to be using the altar because, well, the deeper the world is, the more XP you get from brawling gloves. So th this is the place to use it. Wait, wait, wait. You can use something like, what's it called? Salvation? Gives you wings and 2.5% increase to player experience. All right, let's see. One, bro, these guys are using braziers even in here. Let's see. One bone. Ga oh my God. Bro. <laughs> 6.4k xp <laughs> no way and you can just keep spamming like in runescape 3 you bury them quicker than you would in old school oh man 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 this is way too good wait 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 i forgot the uh, infernal box 6.4k was already xp that i was getting now i'm getting 6.8 Instead of 6.4. So I asked uh, if there's any buffs I need to know when using prayer bra brawling gloves. Because I don't want to forget something. You know, it's already so much XP. Torstal sticks, apparently. Go to world 
211 and get a boost. Oh my god, that is genius. See, I just came in just as I was talking a little bit. I'm already at 8% XP boost. So you craft a magic log into incense sticks because I couldn't buy them in a grand exchange. And then I'm guessing you coat them with ashes. I'm not gonna do this by the way again. This uh, I think the XP is very minuscule anyway. And that makes them into infernal magic incense sticks. Then I guess use a torso and finally finish. How long do these last for? I wonder. Because I feel like I'll, I'll be getting 99 players like so quickly. I will like actual like half an hour maybe. All right, let me light this one and it lasts for 10 minutes. Okay, that will be enough. I'll just crush all of them for 50 minute boost. And it's so nice to just use a Slayer Cape to teleport straight to Mage Bank, you could say it. 54 Wilderness and I can just start burying the bones immediately. And that's a player XP. So 6.9k is what I'm going to be getting uh, the most, it seems. There's also a prayer outfit that gives you plus 6%, but you need to do Actofunctus to get it, and I think that's the only way. And, well, I'm not doing Actofunctus, it's just way too slow. What do you think, I'm grinding stupid bones there? You couldn't even use brawling gloves in there. I wonder what's the XP like if you're doing chewed bones, and you, like, f release those spirits. They give you, like, insane amount of XP on your next bones that you bury, like 300% or something. Maybe you could even see like 20k XP drops. Or maybe not. Last trip I leveled up and it already shows halfway. Wait, it's not even halfway now. It's like actual quarter left until next level. I'm looking at like this thing. Wait, and now as I'm talking it's like already almost fully leveled up and I'm what level 91 prayer. <laughs> it's it's no, it's too fast. It's too good. I'm so so glad that I got these gloves. These are just game changing. Also saving money. I think uh, I initially bought dragon bones for like a hundred mil to get enough for 99, and now I just need even half that. I was doing this uh, the wrong way a little bit. Like you can just drag into your action bar, and you can just press one or whatever the key you bound. You don't have to click on each bone like an old school. That is so interesting. There's a add bones option. So you get uh, like half prayer XP, half fire making, something like that. Well, you do get a little bit of fire making. But if you try to add bones, it says that you cannot do that while wearing those type of brawling gloves. All right, let's see. Current time is 17.13. I still got 900 charges on my brawlers. Let's see, can I do this in like half an hour? Hey, my combat level is 138. I guess that's what you achieve at level 96. And thank you, thank you. Hey, hey, everybody. Oh, oh, like, like I leveled up from 90 to 97 in like 20 minutes. Guys, in absolutely no time, 99 player achieved. Boom, I'll continue using these brawling gloves because I, I don't have the pet. What if I get the pet? And only in Fresh Start Worlds you get the Halo for the pet. So it's like a token that you can get. But yeah, I'm not gonna go for an angst on prayer. I was thinking about it. I, I gotta work on those three skills, you know, Invention, Herblore, Slayer. But I kinda go like also prayer because it's just too much. Guys, looks like no pet. And I don't think I'll be coming back for this. I got 14 charges left. I ran out of bones. Time to go back to Herblord now. All right, I'm gonna stop for a little bit. 102 Herblord. Look, it's going slow. We're trying to get those ranks. All these uncut gems. I think I'm gonna just start with Dragonstone, to be honest. Yeah, let's uh, let's get disappointed once we have to switch from them. Any crafters anywhere? No way. It was all the time in here. There's a well for Herblord. There's a range for cooking. I think that's what I'm gonna use then. No, wait, we have crafter. There's two crafters, actually. Okay, let's see the experience. 400 XP fair. I like it. Good. I mean, look how quickly you get the XP too. So this should be very quick levels. Well, good morning, everybody. I look at the Grand Exchange after I wake up. Uh, there's a lot of, yeah, a lot of stuff. I bought cut diamonds for only 555 each. How much are rubies? I, I paid 111 each, but not that many purchased. And then I bought some Dragonstone at 2.5k each. Guys... You just received the crafting pet. Ah! Uh, wait, it got sent to the bank, right? Wait, my bank was full. Uh oh. There's oh, there's okay. It wasn't full. It was one inventory space. We can ex inspect this and get the achievement, get the halo token. Wait a minute, I'm very curious about this guy. He's uh, rank three, I believe. Uh, 17 more minutes, and I'll hit the daily average of, I guess, 19 hours and a half. He plays average since uh, the whole Fresh Start Worlds started, and he have played in total of 37 days and 14 hours. 
I want to log in to Rune Metrics. Wait, let me let me check how much I played. Oh no, I'm actually slacking. It's 34 days and 12 hours. I played three days less, even though it felt like I played the whole time. But obviously, I would sleep sometimes long, like 12 hours. Like I would actually catch up. I don't know if this guy did. Well, clearly not by playing five hours on average a day. Or, I mean, sleeping for four and a half hours every day. And if you're curious how high scores look like, this is 15 hours in. I click on my profile and I see what skills am I top 100 in. Herblord, yes, I'm still in, but I'm ranked 76. Look at the summoning. I'm currently ranked 91 in just 15 hours. I went from 40 something to 91. Not good. But, like I predicted, invention is still the same. I lost like two ranks because you can't really speed this up yeah sure somebody could have like a lot of augmented items in their bank and they're gonna disassemble everything no, no one's doing that I, okay one person does it who cares two who cares ten even i will get at least one top 100 guys look it's goku with the tail and everything <laughs> <laughs> that's so cool i hope i can get full inventory last inventory that i've done like uh, five minutes ago it gave me 110k mining experience i saved so much time mining is super slow it's like 150k maybe xp an hour sometimes i'm too lazy to do warbands but when you see the 6p 109k and twice so in 12 minutes 200k xp plus it's worth it current level is 92 crafting with plenty of gems left but it's time to switch it up a, a little bit and i want to try agility how much is it? 5.3k pro what? 77 agility, 78. And that's the last of these gloves. There's only one charge remaining. I managed to get 400k XP in just a little bit over one hour. Well, I have another pair, so I could bring that. Guys, you know what time it is now? It is time to crash a bunch of people because there is no way there's going to be any free world. Actually, I'm, I don't know. I wanted to say I heard a lot of bad things about this place how crowded it is and the, the first world that i teleport to which i believe is 211 which is going to be pretty laggy but i guess it doesn't matter too much except that i need to activate my scrimshaw in time but you still get these guys right like these are easily crashable this guy has like i don't know why can't you hide the gear in the worldy 102k xp bro <laughs> I am loving this. I'll try to hop worlds and maybe find a, a better ping because this is just horrible. Look, you just come in, you place a cannon, you don't even ask any questions. Look at this. I'm not even moving. All the people are loading behind this obelisk. I don't even care. I just place a cannon here. The demon ash lord spawns in here and the berserker spawns in here. Always going to get hit by cannons. And I don't waste any time loading because if this guy, the Berserker, spawns in here, the melee guy, and you have to walk him all the way, you're just like, you're losing DPS while walking, you know, unless you're using magic. So, good for you if you are. Guys, in half an hour, I gained 1.4 million Slayer experience. My order is on half the time. It's almost 3 mil XP an hour by not moving, you know, not wasting time loading and so on. 113 Slayer. Guys, melee brawling gloves. I'm not too sure these charges remaining is 3000. That's a lot. That's obviously not for 3000 KC. Oh my god, 225,000 experience. Yeah, that took a lot. Like 500 charges, I think. I can do this a few times and then it's gonna disappear. Those gloves just gonna gone. I wanna see it again. 257k yes i saw fire wars so i was like what the hell is happening it's 90 million attack experience 118 invention has been achieved i think i gained like three magic levels by just using this cannon it's like level 112 already i don't remember training in such a long time one more levels and i can do abyssal lord somebody said it's uh, more xp than these guys but it's not really because then you have to keep getting the tasks over and over, I believe. While well, you get this one task and it lasts for like actual hours because you're just so slow. But it's good because you don't need to get more constantly. That's 119 attack. Guys, just one attack level to go. Which is 10 million, but I mean this whole task that I completed. So if I just get one more task and I fully do it, that's going to be 120 attack. I'm missing what, like 47 million experience until 120. 
if I do 10 mil a day for five days, I should be able to get it. I just did my part today. 11 million experience was gained. Well, I just checked the video. Apparently it's been four hours since I started and I got 11 mil XP. This guy got double abyssal scouts, actually doubled. What did he say it here? Is that one bill item? You know what? I'm going to be a nice guy. I've been leeching all these portables for such a long time without contributing anything of myself i bought these very cheap like 377k each so this is like four mil worth i don't even need to tame herblord anymore i barely have any supplies left but i'll extend this boom 10 uh and now if we examine this should be at 50 minutes 51 minutes boom for free i'm not even gonna use it how nice is that 93 crafting it's time to go afk mining now uh, I, i'm i'm done with this this is not afk at all i've been doing this for so long like uh, how long can you do this for like if you do full inventory 15 seconds let's do five minutes instead yeah afk mining baby did i sell all my juju potions i in fact did not i still got one guys thank you very much for watching this video hope you enjoyed it hopefully we're gonna get more people banned from the front page so i can advance even further <laughs> And I'm currently close to 96 mining. Very close. Okay. Thanks for watching. Bye.